Hello, welcome to Sephra Korea's cooking channel. I am her mom here. Today I am going to show you a beautiful recipe of a uh, vegetable recipe. It's of cauliflower. If you look such beautiful, it just come from the local fields. I have a woman who delivers vegetable at my door. You just see how beautiful this cauliflower is. So I have taken three small ones and along with the tender leaves. Okay, I have put salt salt in the water to soak. Now I will cut this leisurely, finely chop the leaves. I am going to use the leaves also because they are tender. Okay, And these are organically grown. Okay, Give me some time to cut this finely chop and I will get back to you. See, you just see the, the color. And usually, you know, there are insects inside here, but today I don't see anything. Just see how beautiful it is. See the cauliflower. Very beautiful. Dissolved tender leaves, okay. And no putting this in the water again because it has been soaked in the salt for long time. It's all tender, okay, stems. Are you feeling here? Yeah? You know, you feel so happy to cook such a vegetable. She do it herself and sells it. Now I will begin with the method. See, these leaves and cauliflower is finely chopped. Okay, washed well and finely chopped. Lit the gas. Okay, this is the vessel usually I make my vegetables and then I empty it in another vessel to serve it. Okay, it is very convenient for me. Let the vessel be hot. Keep it on high flame. And as you know, I usually use coconut oil for cooking and uh, you know what brand I use. So, I will put in the coconut oil, say about 4 teaspoons. Once the oil is hot, I will put in some mustard, some cumin seeds, let it spurt, few curry leaves, onions, medium flame, make it translucent. Cook the seasoning on a medium flame. You don't have to make it golden brown. You just fry it till it loses its raw flavor. You don't have to make it golden brown. You just fry it till it loses its raw flavor. Now 
now it has become translucent I will put in some salt be very careful when you use salt because do not make it too salty put this half tomato chopped teaspoon of ginger garlic paste saute it nicely put in little turmeric reduce the flame do not allow this to burn put in 2 pinch of asafadeta kolapuri masala and you have seen in my daughter channel how to make kolapuri masala this is ready made mixed red chilli powder and other ingredients so this is a small spoon i use i'll put 4 now to pour in say half a cup of water and cook this let it get cooked for 2 3 minutes so the tomatoes become soft half a cup of water Okay, I will increase, I have increased the flame. Now it is time to put in the cut cauliflower with the tender leaves. Stir it well, increase the flame. To medium high. Okay, you can add another half cup of water. Let it be the flame on medium high. Cover it and allow it to cook. Allow it to cook. And in between you keep on stirring it and check if the cauliflower is cooked because the leaves also have to be, be cooked. Hmm. Let me check if it is cooked. Yes, it is cooked because the water also is, I told you know, sufficient water and timing is okay. Yes, it is done. It's optional huh, if you want to put scraped coconut. I don't want to put. If you want, you can put. I'm putting it off. And serve it hot. You can eat it with whatever you want or eat just like that. I think it's done. Okay, and uh, mind you, you have to put tender leaves only of the cauliflower, not the seasoned one. So, I have chosen and put. 
I know it will be very tasty. I don't want to taste because my cooking is incomplete. I have to cook my other dishes. I'm going to make chicken curry and I'm going to post it on the video. Okay? Thank you.